What's going on video game voter Vanguard? So recently I took a trip to Philadelphia to visit for the first time Two Mini Games, which is a gaming expo. You guys want to know what I picked up? Let's check it out. This is a pickups video for Too Many Games. Uh, Too Many Games is a convention slash expo that's held in Philadelphia once a year. Um, it's two hours away, so I took the ride up. I took my two older sons, my little cousin, took the ride up. Um, so we arrived there, I think like maybe around 12, 1 o'clock, something like that. And first things first, I picked up this awesome shirt. I love the design. It has design and the theme of Super Mario Odyssey, so I definitely had to grab that. Um, um let's get to the games that i picked up i stumbled over my words now this is right after my west coast trip so i can, definitely came back with some money but not as much as you guys seen in the pickup video i i picked up quite a lot so let's get to them uh virtual cop 2 for the sega saturn I had to grab that um wasn't very many sega saturn or sega cd games well let me take that back it was a lot but they were very very expensive so i picked this up I think I paid about 30 bucks for that. Pick that up. Got a couple out at a time. Crash Nitro car for the Xbox. I picked this up, especially being with uh, Crash Team Racing Nitro Fuel just released. I seen that and I picked that up. Platinum Hits for the Xbox. The Simpsons Road Rage. Had to pick that up. Classic game. Um, big anime fan, as you guys know. So I picked up Shonen Jump's Bleach Shatter Blade for the Wii. Uh, I believe this is one of the gems that's on the Wii. The Wii has plenty of gems, so I grabbed that as well. Had to get this. Looks like my case is a little cracked up. Soul Calibur for the Dreamcast. Fantastic game. I played this all the way through to, not completion, but I actually finished the game. Actually at a Retro Gaming Expo playing on the Dreamcast there. So I definitely had to get that, bring it home. Fantastic fighter. I love it so much. Such a great game. Um, here's my actual badge. You guys can see that. I just purchased Saturday because I was only going for one day. Too many games that add to the wall badges. And they also had this um, brochure manual. Uh, basically talked, had a map and who, just, who you can expect to see there at the expo. So that's pretty cool. And it has an Animal Crossing theme to that. So that's pretty cool. Pick up Golden Eye 007 for the N64. You guys already know it's classic. Call this was Call of Duty before Call of Duty. This is to me where it all started from a first person shooter perspective. Absolute classic. Had to grab that. I don't know why I hadn't had it before. So we added that. I also picked up for five bucks WCW vs. Royal. Again, I'm a big wrestling fan, as you guys know. So I picked that up. This was one of the games that I think they were late, leading into the THQ days. Um, this was like a bet, way better than Nitro, I believe. So I picked that up. Sealed, well not sealed, but uh, Jet Grind Radio had to get that. Um, I almost bought one in Seattle at Pink Gorilla Games, but Kelsey actually had a sealed copy. Um, it's not that I didn't have the money, but... I wanted to play the game, so I felt like if I got that game that I didn't want to open it. So I was like, let me just wait. I'll be at too many games in a couple weeks, so I'll try there. And, you know, I found this copy there, picked that up. And last but not least, and I normally don't do this, but I wanted this game. I was playing it um, at Seattle Retro Game Expo. And like I said, I normally don't do it. I normally buy games with the cases at least because I like to display my games on my collection. But I picked up House of the Dead 2 for the Dreamcast, so I'll look for the case. If any of the video game voter Vanguard has that case laying around or something like that and lost the game, if you would like to donate it to me or sell it to me, please comment down in the comment section below. Let me know if you got it. I would surely appreciate that. But this is an absolute classic game. I had to get it uh, for the price. I think I talked the guy into 10 bucks, so that was pretty cool that I picked that up. So. Those are my pickups for too many games. Again, it wasn't as much because, as you guys know, I just came back from West Coast and that was enough money being spent out there in Los Angeles, Vegas, as well as Seattle. So, uh, again, a big thank you to the Video Game Voting Vanguard. I appreciate you guys and the continued support. Um, we also got a Facebook group, uh, Video Game Voting Vanguard. If you haven't liked and been added to that group, please go on Facebook, type in Video Game Voting Vanguard. It should pop up. 
we'll get you added in. It's basically group for fellow gamers, enthusiasts. We just have conversations. It's just a place for us to go and gather and just have a conversation and just, you know, possibly meet up and stuff like that. I got a couple cool guys, my big supporters that run that. Shout out to both Chris's, Dustin. Uh, I hope I ain't forgetting nobody's names, but I appreciate y'all so, so much. Y'all have no idea. I'm telling you, when I come to your city, we're going to have a good time. We're going to hang out. We're going to turn up. We're going to do everything. I'm telling you, and everything on me. I don't have no problem showing love to the people who support me. And those guys are my friends. I haven't met them in person, but those dudes are my friends. They they hold me down so much, and I'm truly grateful to the video game for the band, God. And last but not least like before you know we're, we're gonna be there you know i've got continued support and people just encouraging me with the channel thank you i appreciate it so much also before i forget while we had too many games i got the chance to meet a couple people one being nintendo uh nintendo is a youtuber um he's a big nintendo fan obviously that's how the name came apart came about and i recently became a fan of his channel uh i'll link his channel in the description uh you you can check him out very smart guy super cool um i actually sent him a tweet because i seen on john riggs page that he was actually there sent him a tweet say hey are you still at too many games i was actually leaving and he tweeted me back he's like yeah if you hang around you know in this area we can meet up and he definitely did he held up his word and we got a picture and you guys will see that so shout out to the 10 drew thank you appreciate you uh also i got to finally meet John Riggs. John Riggs is super cool, big YouTuber, a frequent guest on Metal Jesus Rock's YouTube channel. We had been uh, having a conversation for a few months. He recognized me before I walked up. It was super awesome. It felt good. I gave him my shirt. Um, he's a super cool dude. He also had my shirt in his pickups video, so I'll also link his video below. Uh, thank you John Riggs for the continued support that dude is super awesome. Thank you so much I appreciate it and again. Thank you to the video game voting Vanguard So we're gonna end the episode on that note. This has been the too many games pickup. It's your boy the video game voter. We out